guys, how are we doing today? Lance here at Trans West Trek Killer RV, located in Belton, Missouri. A little nippy out here today, but man, I'm excited to talk to you guys about this 2005. It's a Holiday Rambler Navigator. This was top of the line coach. It has a Series 60 Detroit diesel motor. So 515 uh, horsepower with about 1,650 pounds of torque. Loaded with power. This is gonna be sitting on what's called a Roadmaster chassis. It's a very special, unique chassis. What you get with that is you're in the typical diesel pushers have about 10 airbag, I mean, four airbags. This is gonna come with 10. You're gonna have a really big airbag here in the front and you can see right there, one behind it. So in the front of the tire, behind the tire, and they are brought towards the outer wall. So it has a little bit wider of a stance. Typical airbags are a little bit, uh, sit a little bit inside. So you get this rocking motion with RVs with the Roadmaster chassis with those airbags out on the outriggers like that. It's a little bit stronger. So when you're getting side winds helps counteract that. This is gonna have more rad. So it's got uh, that um, collision avoidance system. So if somebody's beside you, it's gonna help you to det uh, de detect it. Whew, a little cold out here. So your uh, this is gonna be your diesel tank and your propane. What's nice about this is it runs the full width of the coach on both sides. So it helps with uh, uh, balancing out the uh, liquids instead of having all that weight on one side. Pretty nice feature. Got some nice pass-through storage here. Got a nice uh, couple of slide trays. Um, now, the uh, Holiday Rambler does have a water manifold system in there, so you can isolate any kind of plumbing issue, uh, turn off one thing and continue to keep running uh, water throughout the coach. You do got the power window awnings here. So this is gonna be a, uh, what is this, a 43 PBQ tag axle. You're gonna have, again, the front and rear airbag, and then the tag axle actually gets a couple of airbags as well in between the tires there. You got your battery battery uh, slide out trays here down below. Nice little place to come here to check your fuses. You don't have to crawl in underneath the dash. Now this is uh, what it's all about. Got your Detroit Series 60 diesel motor back here. Uh, very sought after motor. Now this coach has got a lot of smart technology built into it for an 05. There's a lot of newer diesels that don't have what this thing has. It's got the automatic traction control. So slippery conditions, it's gonna keep keeping a lot better control. Got your side mounted radiator. Um, now, one of the things that I can appreciate, now this is all gonna be built on a semi monocoque uh, chassis. This is all gonna have tubular steel in the wall. The uh, front is all built in with a steel cage. So extremely safe. Uh, if there was ever an accident, it's gonna take that on uh, a lot better. You've got your uh, macerator pump in there. Everything's gonna be on a, a power cord reel. And if you look at the bracketry on these doors, they're just heavy duty, right? Just, I mean, you just don't get stuff built like that anymore. Just a very nice, very, very nice uh, heavy duty. I mean, that shuts like a car door. You got all these doors that open side mount, right? Very nice, that way it allows me to kind of get in here and belly right up to my storage. All right guys, coming up here, you're gonna see uh, that this does have the side cameras. You've got a triple mirror here, which is nice. They're all power mirror. And you do got your um, blinkers that are detected right here in the mirrors. So pretty nice. This is gonna have a 10,000 kilowatt diesel generator, one piece windshield. A lot, of, a lot of your older coaches like this will have a bar down the middle of the, the windshield. This doesn't. And this is gonna be part of your Vorad system. So this does have also adaptive cruise control. So a lot of neat features built into this coach. Well guys, that does it for the outside. Let's go take a look and see what we got coming into the coach. And as you can see, it does have the keyless entry. All right guys, well welcome to the inside of this beautiful Holiday Rambler Navigator. Um, there's just a lot of neat features that this thing's got going on for it. It's going to have a lot of smart technology built into this coach. Now, um, it's got some beautiful, I like, I like these chrome bezels up here, just really nicely done. Um, even the, the seats are super high tech, the, uh, the automatic power seats. So you've got your normal 
That's two, four. You got six-way control right here, just on this one button. But then you also got uh, you can control just the seat itself, and then the chair itself says stationary. So just very nice. You've got your lumbar controls. You got memory seating. So just a lot going on uh, with this coach. You got your VIP smart wheel system, your cruise control, um, your windshield wipers. A lot of that's uh, already built into the steering wheel. Pretty nice. You even got yourself a, a CB. You got adjustable pedals. So just a lot of nice high-end features that you would expect in a high-end luxury coach. And that's what you get with this coach. Now, as we come into this coach, uh, I just want to point out, this is all real solid cherry wood. So beautiful cherry cabinets. So one thing about a luxury coach, when you have hardwoods like this, they stand the test of time. So maintains uh, the beauty. There's a lot of coaches out here that just don't even have uh, this look. You got that photo laminate nowadays, particle board. You're not gonna get that with this coach. So got a nice couch here. Um, now, these chairs do turn around and swivel, but for those who might want to work, maybe telecommute uh, from home, you got a nice little workstation here. Now this is going to be, uh, there should be a slide button here. Okay, well we found it. It's right here, just underneath the cabinet. So this is going to be a day and night shade. This is going to be a power shade. So you can bring this up or you can bring it down. Now that's going to be the night version. You just continue to keep holding it and it'll open up for your day shade. So pretty nice feature there. And these are just some of the nice features that you get in this in this particular coach. So you got yourself a nice dinette here. Um, I do like the fact that this is a nice flush floor. Some of these older coaches, they actually sit on platforms. So uh, just across from us, we got our nice, beautiful dinette. I mean, uh, uh, solid surface kitchen countertops and really good sized burners. Man, these are some, you can get some pretty good sized pans here. Uh, I do like the fact that it's a flat grate. You can kind of slide your pan around. Nice deep countertops. Now, previous owner did get us the uh, owner's manuals. So you got everything you need here. Every system in this coach is gonna be in these two uh, boxes, which is gonna be nice. And then we've got a double uh, vanity sink So pretty nice got your little telescoping mowing faucet Soap dispenser purified water Residential whirlpool refrigerator right across from us with it's got the ice maker and water dispenser built right into the door Now coming into the bathroom, I'm gonna actually have you uh, Pass me here um, I'm gonna close this door now these doors are very solid you've got this nice mirror inlay here so you need to get ready before the night out in the town you got a nice door built in there and then there is another door here all beautiful solid tray wood that will close off the bathroom as well nice good solid shower here And beautiful tile inlay here halfway up through the the walls here you got the adjustable shower head so for somebody who's a little bit taller now I'm I'm about six one with my shoes on you've got all this space up here I've got my hand completely extended so for all you tall folks out there that's gonna work out perfect now across from us we got our bathroom what I like about this if somebody's in here using the bathroom you're not trapped in the bedroom so you've got a sink in there, and you've also got a sink in here as well. So having that dual sink can be pretty useful. Now coming into the bedroom, this is actually really nice. Big, beautiful king bed. And, uh, and just, a, just at the end of the foot of the bed here, you've got all those beautiful cherry cabinets again, just loaded with storage. Nice, big, deep drawers. And then, um, at the head of the bed, you've got a couple of different options here. You've got your radio station, but you've also got a, uh, a lot of your different controls. So you've got your uh, display lights, generator stop. You can turn your lights on from here, outside docking lights, ceiling lights. 
Um, just a lot of neat little features there. And then um, the aft part of the coach, you can get a little laundry done. I like the location of it. As you're doing your laundry, right here onto the bed, you fold it all up, goes right in the drawers, put it on the hanger, and you're good to go. And let's see, we've got a pretty good sized closet here, it looks like. So, very well lit, lots of room back there. All right guys, well that does it for this 2005 Holiday Rambo Navigator. If you've got questions or you'd like to maybe do a FaceTime video, give me a call, love to help you. Thank you.